So the OSS provides seamless support to combat flight operations at both Bagram Airfield and Jalalabad Airfield, and we provide certain levels of support to Kandahar Airfield and several other airfields around the uh, Afghanistan AOR as well. The different functions of the OSS are uh, the intelligence flight, we have weapons and tactics flight, so both of those are wing functions. We also have wing aircrew flight equipment, then we have current operations, airfield operations, and then the uh, Jalalabad uh, OLA. It really comes down to just relying on those experts. and. And that is exactly what the OSS has. We have just a whole variety of experts who know exactly what they're doing. And, and so the fact is that every single one of them I know is, is passionate about supporting the mission, both their, their kind of their specific lane of the mission as well as the overarching mission of, of combat operations in Afghanistan. So day by day at Jalalabad, I work side by side with two other Air Force members. So the three of us together try to manage and execute daily operations of everything inside of the airfield. It is challenging and a tremendous amount of it is trying to understand the different complex requirements that all of our users have. Jalalabad has an enormous amount of Army users, Army aviation that is there, primarily helicopters. And we have UAS units that are there from a diverse background and a number of other users that come in and out of the field to conduct operations in the local area. I think some of the most rewarding opportunities are seeing the completion of projects that you start and being able to talk to users of the airfield and people that you support directly and have them express appreciation for the level of support, the flexibility of support that the airfield was able to provide. Being good at your job, providing the information, the timely and accurate information, is absolutely critical to the mission. And so uh, that is one of the first things we try to do when, when people show up here in the squadron, or even before they get here, we send them a welcome guide so that they know, one, here's all the crazy stuff that the OSS does, and two, what you do is very, very important to the mission. And, uh, and so that is... Uh, it's something that we work on right from the very beginning and then uh, we try to kind of reinforce that as, as things go on so people don't, they don't forget that what they're doing is, is so much bigger than their day-to-day -day operations.